Hello everyone. Today we'll be seeing how we can upload and display images using Flask. Uh, let me give a bit of a description of this application. So what we'll be doing is we will develop a full stack photo sharing application using Flask and technologies like Python, HTML, CSS. So the home page of this application will look something like this. It is going. It will be a dashboard of all the uploaded photos. It will be a grid-like structure with three images in a row. Uh, after every successful upload, the the new photo is going to appear at the first, and uh, it will shift all other photos by one position. And the, the formats acceptable are only image formats that is JPEG, JPEG, and PNG. Users can upload images through the front end and the images are viewable in the same front end. So this website is also deployed and you can check it out here. So this is how the front end looks. Uh, whenever you will upload an image, I have already down downloaded a few images. So let us upload one. As you can see beam was already present so let us upload another image so this is the new image and it is appearing at the first right now and all other images got shifted by one let us upload another one so see this is working the, these images are stored in the static folder uploads if you delete a um, couple of images then you will see that uh, you cannot see on the front end as well now let us have a look at the code so this is the index.html uh, which is the home page of our application what we have is here is simply a form uh, with, through which we will be uploading our images uh, after uh, when we select our image what it will do is it will redirect us to the upload route which we have in our flask application.py file so this is the upload route it will accept the post method as we are uploading an image we will be using the post method yeah so this is the form so after submitting what will happen is uh, we will be getting all the details of the particular image using the request module uh, and we will also get the file name using this particular uh, function secure underscore file name so what we do is is like uh, we cannot just trust anyone uh, maybe there are some issues with the file name and sometimes they can be dangerous this is what the documentation says that's why you, we use this particular function secure underscore file name you can read more about it now what we will do is to save the file we will first need the path where we have to save this particular file so I am saving the file in static uploads folder so images whenever we need to display images in flask we always save it in static folder now what we'll do is we will uh, we will give the variable upload underscore path this particular name and append it with the file name so when we save this uh, it will automatically be saved in this particular folder that is a project static and uploads so the images and all such data is stored in static and our html is stored in, uh, is stored in templates this is how it works in flask so once the image is stored we will be redirected back to the home page that is the default route now what again it will do is uh, it will uh, check this particular path and the list all the uh, whatever is present in this particular folder that is the path uh, as our problem statement has that uh, the latest uploaded images should be displayed at the beginning and then the older and so on 
so what logic I applied here is that we will first list all the whatever is present in this folder and then sort it using the get c time function so this is going to sort all the whatever uh, files are present in the directory in uh, the like date using its date and time of overflow but how it will sort is like the uh, the oldest image will be present in at the beginning in this particular array but we want the latest image to be at the first in this array so what i am doing is again reversing this array so after reverse i will be passing this array back to the front end in uploads as uploads variable so now uh, we will be again uh, directed back to index.html that is our front end and this uploads variable we will be looping through it like we will be looping through this array that is uploads and displaying each image one by one but before displaying we will check if the format is png jpg or jpeg only then we will be displaying this is our validation and along with that we will also display the name of the image below each image and then we will end dependent for so like this is the jinja template uh, when uh, using loops or conditional you need to use the jinja to template in flask so this is the basic working of our application i will also show it one more time so this is how it works i will give the github link of this project below and you can also try out the live application which is hosted here on my blog thank you everyone